Hello, Stevie. So I'm headed to the Lincoln, Nebraska Motor Skills Challenge, and believe it or not, I'm late. Let's get there. So we made it to the, I'll have Molly tell you everything here Brian and Kevin are going to help me out and kind of go over this with you guys. We had a meeting earlier, we talked about the points and, and how it's going to be judged. If you touch a cone, rub, displace, or yeah, move it, it's a one second added to it. Knocking down a cone, that's two seconds added to your time. Putting a foot down, that's three seconds. A bike down, excuse me, that's five seconds. Uh, run out of the exercise, that means re and re-enter at the same location, that's plus eight. Improper path, direction, through pattern, that's 10 seconds. Run out of the exercise, re-enter at a different, wrong location, that's 20, that's 20 seconds. Intentional short coursing, that's 50 seconds. Any questions about how we're riding this? Want to walk it? Don't be shy. If you really want to walk it, we'll walk it. Only takes a second. Yeah, it doesn't take long. We just want to make sure. You want to, want to go through? Okay. So, you're going to be a novice? Yeah. Okay, we'll work novice. Kurt's going to demo it for us. He's not going to look like a novice. Well, he'll make himself look like one. So this here behind me is the regular course, and then this is the expert course, which the cops and stuff are going to compete on. Got to come back this way. This cone will be on your left side. Number four will be on your right side. <laughs> that guy talking is the guy that I just put my camera on his bike. Pretty cool guy. I've met him before. Roll Tide 530s here. You guys saw his bike already. We'll go and talk with Scott here in a little bit. one of Lincoln PD's bikes. I don't think they're competing in this, but they're here. Represent. I'll stand or, and uh, remove your hats for the national anthem. Nice. You follow us. May the angels guard our travels for they know what is ahead of us. Keep us safe through swirling turns and rolling hills and let the eagles guide us to the mountain tops. Let the moon's light guide us through the night. And Lord, thank you for letting us all be bikers. Amen. Amen. friends you guys know roll tide 530 scott and his buddy scott from the blue knights
Seven, so everybody, this is Molly. Molly put this whole event on all by herself. No, nobody not helped close. her. <laughs> she did all by herself. So where are we? And what are we doing? Um, we're out here at uh, Frontier Frontier Harley Davidson out here in uh, Lincoln, Nebraska, and I just had this crazy idea one night that uh, we need to do a safety festival, and this is how it turned out. So. Um, we've got about 30 people competing today, um, doing the cone courses, and we've got a slow race and all kinds of stuff. We got some great vendors out here, Triple A's even out here, which is amazing. As a biker community knows, it's uh, not always been the best relationship with them. So <laughs> we're glad to have them out here. We've got the Safety Council. We've got a Bait District Two out here. Um, great sponsors. It's been a lot of fun. It was just a weird idea I had one night because of talking about the helmet law. So right. Here we are. And big thanks to Frontier Harley Davidson yes. for they've been great. And you stopped donating us a ton of ice. Um, we can't thank them enough for that. Um, we have a, some great sponsors. Hopefully, you got some pictures of those uh, over by the semi mm -hmm. display we had over there. We had a semi display that was supposed to have uh, blind spots for motorcycles on a semi, but uh, unfortunately, we had too many motorcycles. So. There's a lot of motorcycles around that semi right now, so <laughs> that didn't work out so well. But it's been a beautiful day, and it's been a lot of fun, and we've had a great turnout. We've had people from Texas and Arkansas here today. Some guys from Illinois stopped through, which was really cool. Um, and it's been a it's been a great day. It's been absolutely fabulous. And Bellevue Police are Bellevue here. Bellevue Police and, and the Lincoln Police Lincoln are here, police are here. Uh, hanging out Not with us. Not because they're Not checking because up on us. Not because we're in trouble, no. They're actually <laughs> over there being good. They're just hanging right. out. The cops need to be good. <laughs> and so, uh, yeah, and it's uh, the Lincoln Blue Knights, they've done a lot of work and they donated all these cones to us, which um, I think there's something like 3,000 cones out here right now. So That's crazy. It's a lot of fun and uh, we're going to go get set up for the slow race and then um, after that we're going to do the cone race and it's going to be the, the ball, cone ball race, you know, with the passenger. Mm -hmm. yeah, so That'll be exciting. Get ready to rock and roll. So are you doing that? No, absolutely not. <laughs> not unless you're riding. I got my roking here. I got my roking here too. <laughs> we both have really little yeah, passenger we, seats. Yeah, no, we do. <laughs> and I don't have so, any back pegs. So, yeah, <laughs> so it's well, going to work out real well. That's, you going to be on hard. the back? I don't think that would look right either. <laughs> it wouldn't look wrong, would it? <laughs> I don't know. Amy might like it. <laughs> <laughs> she wouldn't care. Anyway. So, big thanks to Molly for putting all this on. I got a ton of volunteers, though, that helped me out uh, Kevin Ray and Rick Jones and. Um, John and Tammy and I can't even tell Sharon I mean there's a thousand of them out here and uh, I couldn't have done 99.9% .9 of this without those guys so. so will this be a yearly event we are hoping so uh, Frontier has actually already invited us back for next year so that's cool yeah we're All excited right. so yearly event you guys we yeah. don't obviously we don't know the date uh, no, not yet. This was kind of spurred the moment because I just thought of this earlier this year and we just made it happen and unfortunately we picked the wrong Saturday because it's about 102 yeah, degrees hot. out here or so but it's uh, warm um, yeah, I should have picked last Saturday, <laughs> but uh, next Saturday would have been all right too. <laughs> you know, we, we can't control the season. weather. We, we cannot football. control the weather. We can't control the weather or football season. We don't <laughs> right. football season, so <laughs> you know yeah, it's hard to hard to like, pick. But hopefully next year we can maybe do it a little earlier in the year and uh, bring more awareness. All I really wanted to do is just save one life. So we can mm -hmm. save one life and maybe teach somebody something and um, change people's minds about how people really ride motorcycles because this is an art form to me. Yeah. It's amazing to watch. So I'm not doing it for real. Heck no, man. <laughs> I might be able to do some of this stuff, but not in cones and not in front of people. I think after it's all over, we should run the course once. I think you might have smoked something you shouldn't have smoked on the way. <laughs> Very hard, Judge. Yeah, I appreciate that.
be rough. I got one on. There's two on. Come on, baby. Woo! All right. Nicely done. So the whole point of this is the all riders right, got a passenger. Right. They got to put a ball on each cone. So they're over there doing the last of the raffles. That's gonna do it from here at the, uh, it's this. <laughs> the Lincoln Nebraska Skills Challenge. We'll be seeing you guys again soon. It's been a hell of a day. Uh, it's a great cause, so check it out next year if you're in the area. So guys, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you wanna see more stuff like this, subscribe. Hit the bell notification so you know when we load up next. And until next time, we'll see you guys on the road.